All right. Well, we're here I'm with Swa, and this is great because Swa has worked diligently on two projects launching at the same time. So, uh, congratulations. Thank you so much, okay. Kenny. So this is really cool. This is the immersive one. Okay, so this is the Seven Jeweled Mountain, and this is in North Korea, correct? Yes, this uh, natural wonder is currently in North Korea. Okay, and, and talk to us about this art piece. This is huge. Yeah, this is a, a early 19th century Korean folding screen depicted this mountain. Okay. And then called a uh, Seven Joe Mountain. Okay, and uh, so it's interesting because the the legend is there's seven jewels buried somewhere in here, and then the the mountain range is one of seven mountain ranges that are considered the seven jewels. Absolutely. So six others are you know are believed to sink down, but the, this mountain range is only one survived. Okay. So it's a really the locals admire this mountain. Also, a lot of you know uh, elite and other you know people. From from the other provinces gotcha. and visit this mountain. So we're gonna come on in because it's immersive experience. Okay, so uh, all right, so this is great. Now you and your team created this immersive experience. Um, the the gentleman in the 16th century, correct? Yes. Who actually went to um, went to climb the, mm -hmm. uh, the top of the mountain, he had a journal. Absolutely. He and wrote a very detailed journal describing the weather and also day to day, you know, visit the different sites. So we literally, through this immersive experience, we're going on his journey. Now, you guys, there's, there's, there's music and there's narration and everything else. We had that turned down so mm -hmm. we can talk. But it takes you on his journey, literally according to his journal, right? Absolutely. All the text that you are seeing is uh, directly from his diary. Mm. And um, it was a, about a five-day journey. Yes. He got there at night. Yes. Uh, and went to the temple and went to bed because he was tired. And then right. this describes uh, the rest of the four days it took to get him, what he saw, and all the images are taken directly from uh, that screen. Correct? Yes, because we didn't want to add any fictional audition uh, to this digital immersive exhibition. We want to be very truthful to the painting. Mm -hmm. And then after our audience saw this, uh, see this exhibition, and then have uh, go back and then enjoy the painting itself. As we wrap up, this is being shared with our sister museum in Seoul, South, uh, South, South Korea. Korea. So at the same time, they're watching what we're watching. Absolutely. But we created it here in Cleveland. Yes, absolutely. So awesome. mm -hmm. Okay, um, we're running out of time. You've done so much. There he is. He's on his little truck there. Uh, this is included with, you know, you know, when you come in because it's a free a museum. This is so incredibly amazing. I, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm there with him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, we're going to go back to you guys in the studio because uh, so I also anyway, worked I like on this. an amazing Korean couture. Yeah, oh, cool. isn't it great? Oh, yeah, cool. it's yeah. so awesome. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, I will be back. <laughs> yeah.